Uh, yeah, there's some more arrows right there. Well, you won't be shooting these arrows. There's that guy. Is there anything up here I can sabotage? That'd be the best place to put uh some poison <laughs> in the ale. There's another cook pot here. Oh. You're in the wrong place at the wrong time. Uh oh. I'm not, I'm not in the wrong place at the wrong time. You are. Alright, hopefully. That didn't alert too many people. Alright, so let's drop into pot another Bane potion. The and secret is in the spices. Indeed, it is. Maybe he won't see me. Then I can sneak up on him. Ooh, yeah. Okay, let me sneak over here for somebody else shows up. Uh, I don't know how I've done it, but I've successfully taken out two cook pots. Nearly a whole camp of bandits. Good ground for a big fight, but not much cover. No, not much cover at all. I'm not sure how many bandits are left. If there's a lot or not. I'm trying to scout the whole camp out. Are you calling for your friends? Because they're gone. They're all gone. You just didn't know it. A lot of nighttime patrols. But I'll see to them for sure. Don't you worry about that. Uh oh. Uh oh. Guy with no torch just scared me. You talking to me or my dog? Can I sneak up on you without you getting in front of a bunch of people? Sure can't. Hmm. You guys are on high alert. Calm down. Ain't nobody here. Oh. Jeez, I got some tough, tough cookies patrolling. Well, I thought over here was another entrance to the base. But it's not. But I'm curious about these barricades being here. I guess it's just to watch the road, maybe? Is it morning? Oh my goodness, it's almost morning. And I started at 11.30, so... I made sure it was dark. But not too dark. You know what I mean? Okay. Maybe I can draw people out. Yeah, I got that guy. We'll see if he checks out his friend's death. Yeah, somebody's gonna walk over there. Not a single person, huh? Well, somebody's about to do it. Somebody's gonna walk over there. Come on. Somebody's gotta do it. Hey, stop hitting my dog. Oh, I don't know. Come check it out.
<laughs> oh no. Can they not figure out where I'm at? Raise the alarm. Don't look at me. The arm! Get over here! <laughs> what is going on? First they have like 5,000 arrows. Over here. And now Get this. Quick. And now this. No, don't hit me. Get over here. Well, I never. The pig. Hey, all of you! Ooh, ooh. Alarm! Come on, frames. Don't do this to me now. Mm -mm, don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Ooh. Again, apologies for the frames. Good night. I don't know what's going on here. Who's there? What are you doing here? Good part of life, hey, are you? All of you, gather here! Raise the Lost alarm! Your wind. Uh, 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 uh. Ooh, I can't see you? nothing. Bring it on! Oh, oh. All your friends are dead, man. Oh. About to try and give up? I don't think so, dude. Ooh. Get me out of this corner. Ooh. I can't see nothing. Ooh. Oh, gosh. Hey, I blocked that one. That ain't fair. Hmm. The hammer's vicious. What's the matter? Come on. Ha! Had enough? Oh. Take that. Come on. Oh. Bleeding now. Come on, man. I'm in full concentration mode, apologize. Oh, just try not to die. Oh. 
Oh no, 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 no. Let me get my ble <laughs> bleeding under control here. And let's take oop. Take one of those. I don't know who they're calling now. I feel like I pretty much killed everybody. Yeah, I got that guy. Okay. Woo! All right. I think I cleared the camp. <clears throat> Pretty much. Be surprised if there's anybody left. And, uh, man, I don't know what to do about the frames. They're just going nuts right now. Look at the arrows they have. It's insane. Hashtag unbothered. So, you're the cheater. Ah, uh, don't hit me. No. All right, are we going <laughs> to quote unquote sneak in here? Can you shut up? Please. Yes, you found me. My goodness. That door's shut. They can see a long way from that steeple. And those archers up there, definitely going to be a... Well, you won't be shooting these arrows. Uh, okay. What a stinking shithole. I wouldn't want to live here. It is a poo-poo hole, isn't it? <coughs> Excuse me. Dude, I almost cursed and I coughed. Uh, drop in the pot. The Bane Potion. Yeah. Yep, it is. The fewer arrows you have, the better for us. Okay, yeah, so we did all the arrows. Gave me a little good check mark there. And then this should be the last. Oops. Food. Hey, yep. That's all their food. So is there anything else to sabotage? Go back to Sir Radzik. Uh. I mean, I killed everybody, so I can run around now. <laughs> I've never done that before. Always thought there was too many, but I don't need ten lockpicks. Thank you, though. All these pick, 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 pick boxes. All these lockpick boxes are a cinch for me. What kind of ch uh, a shielded, decorated shield, decorated. I'm stumbling on my words. I apologize. What you got in here? Armors and stuff? Nothing. Nothing good. Well, let's go back to Sir Radzig. I think uh, we did a pretty good job cleaning this place up. And uh, <clears throat> if it wasn't for them getting like stuck here, they were like, "What's, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on?" It would have been a lot harder because my frames were dropping, and there's not a guard left. There's not any patrols left. Uh, so if you caught the quick point of that. If you, uh, if I, I don't know how much I'm going to cut that. You know, it was a lot, but uh, it took me about 30 minutes-ish. Probably would have went faster if I didn't uh, have such bad frame drops. I don't know what was up with that, but I was going to say I should have ate from one of those pots. But <laughs> I poisoned them and I would have killed myself. Here we are about to speak to Sir Radzik. Might shut up. Um, and off camera, I went ahead and got me a couple of scarlet shields. I was wondering where you get them. And I just, let's just say I got them off some guards. And uh, we got a few of them now. So I'm going to put one of those on. And okay, I didn't think my bow was equipped there for a second. I don't know why. Um, I got some loot I need to sell, but we're going to talk to Sir Radzik and let him know that. Priv Privislavitz is pretty much sabotaged. God be with you, Henry. Congratulations on winning the tournament. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of me? Sir Razzy, you're like a dad. To me, to say that you're proud of me is is such an honor. Um, well, I'm back from scouting. I'm back from scouting, sir. Excellent. What have you found out? Um, 
Uh, it's in some overgrown ruins. There's an overgrown ruined village in the woods where they're dug in. That sounds like Pribislavitz. It used to belong to Sir Divish before Havel Maddock attacked and torched it, and then imprisoned Divish. It's been left abandoned ever since. I was hoping they wouldn't be so organized. Earthworks and fortifications. That's quite a different matter from writing some rabble out of the woods. Sure. Uh, I tried to count them. I tried to count them. I murdered them. And how many of them are there? Bear in mind I'm relying on what you say. We'll have to call for reinforcements, and that's no simple matter. Every man that comes with us will be lacking somewhere else. And I don't want bandits pillaging some other town because there's no one left to mount a defense. Um... Uh, there's, there's quite a few of them. There's quite a few of them there. Perdition. We'll definitely need reinforcements. I think the Talmberg men should suffice. I don't like leaving the castle unprotected, but there's no other option. Um, there's Cumans there. There aren't just bandits in the camp. There are Cumans too, quite a few of them. Cumans, you say? Where the hell did they come from? Could Sigismund have left them there after he raised scouts? This is looking more and more serious. <laughs> this guy singing in the back. Go away. I see you. Their arms and armor. I took a look at their arms and armor. They're not a proper army, but they're equipped quite well. What about archers? Oh, they're positioned well. There's a few of them, and they're positioned well. If we charge them head on, they'll probably do us a lot of damage. I don't like the sound of that. It complicates the situation. Dealing with them before the battle would be the best option. They're making some ladders in the camp. They're up to something in the middle of the camp. It looked like they were making several long ladders. Ladders? That sounds like they're planning a siege. I like this less and less. On the other hand, we can use that to our advantage. If we can capture those ladders, we can use them to scale their own fortifications. Uh... Didn't find anything else out. That's about all I saw, sir. I didn't notice anything else. That's all right. Did you manage any sabotage while you were there, as I asked you? Actually, now that you asked, I destroyed their arrows. I managed to destroy some of their arrow supplies, so they'll have less ammunition. Well done. That's just what we need. And I also poisoned a food pot. I managed to slip poison to a few of them. They should be too sick to fight. You're as cunning as a fox. We need more like you. That's all, sir. Don't worry, Henry. You've proven yourself an excellent spy. I need you to go to Sir Divish in Talmberg and tell him to send Captain Robard and his men to our aid. There's not enough of us here in the camp. You can rely on me, sir. What should I tell him? Tell him to take all his men. Leave only the bare minimum at the castle and march to Pribislavitz. I'll take everyone but for one or two sentries. Hopefully together we'll have enough men to defeat them. Oh, uh, well, right, I'll get going. We'll have plenty, don't. Don't worry. Be quick. We've no time to spare. God be with you. Good luck, man. All right, well, you guys know what that means. It's time to suit up. We're going to suit up and we I did sabotage them. All right, here we are at Tomberg. First thing in the morning and I'm suited up for battle. And so this is my gear. Uh, I'm just going to just try to rep some scallops up in here. It's got that stuff. And we need to talk to Sir Divish or Sir Robard. I'm not sure. I think Divish has to give the command to move the troops. So we'll talk to him. And thankfully he's here in the courtyard. Hello, good sir. God bless you. What troubles you? Uh, I may have visited your wife. I mean, um. I hope all is well in your fiefdom. No, no, no. Well, Sir Radzik can ask for reinforcements. Sir sent me with an important message. He asked for reinforcements. He needs more men? What's going on? The bandits and Cumans have set up camp in Pribislavitz. They're preparing for something. Sir Radzik wants to mount an assault on them, but he doesn't have enough men. Hang on. Easy now. From the beginning. What happened? I managed to track down the camp of the bandits who raided Neuhof. But it's not just a gang of brigands. More like a small army in a fortified encampment. I don't know what they're up to, but I'm sure they're getting ready for something. And Sir Radzig wants to destroy them before they get a chance. So it's worse than I thought. 
But Sir Radzik is right. We should do something about them before it's too late. I'll send my soldiers. Okay. Sir Radzik said to take all your men and leave only a minimum guard at the castle. What? Everyone? There really are a lot of them, Sir Divish. He's leaving the camp almost empty, too. We're to go and join his people in Pribislavitz and mount an assault together. All right, then. Sir Radzik knows what he's doing. I'll muster the men and send them with Captain Robard in command. Would you lead my men there right now? Uh, yeah. Yes, sir. May God be with you in battle. Goodbye. Uh, I'm ready for battle, so we're gonna go talk to Sir Divish. We're gonna charge straight in. Roger. I'm glad to see you, Captain Robard. I hope Henry's explained everything to you. He did, but I find it hard to believe. Who could possibly put together such a significant military force, and right under our noses? We'll just have to find out, but I don't think we will until after a battle. If we don't deal with them now, who knows what they'll be capable of in a week or two. I agree entirely, my lord. What's the plan? Right, lad. We're almost at the place you described. Now we'll have to advance cautiously. I need you to tell me how it looks around the camp so I can decide which side to lead the attack from. Sir, that's a big responsibility. I don't think I should... I asked you a question, boy. You've been there and seen everything, so speak up. Oh, um... There are three ways to get in. Directly along the straight path to the camp, the long way round through the woods and over an old weir, or by a narrow bridge over a deep ditch. Let's start with the direct route. That sounds like the easiest approach. How does it look there? That path leads round their battlements. It's fortified and patrolled. The chances are they'd shower us with arrows on the way. It's a good thing you're here, Henry. We'll have to try another way then. What about the approach through the woods and the weir? I don't like the idea of marching such a long way over rough ground, but if it's the better option... It's a long way through the woods, and there are patrols there as well. They'll call the alarm before we reach the camp. I thought so. What about the last approach, over the bridge? It's a bit narrow for my liking. It's narrow, all right, but once we get over, we can quickly occupy the best ground for a battle. We only have to take down a few archers. The battleground sounds inviting, but that bridge and the archers... It's not an easy decision. Each option has its pros and cons. Well, I try to answer to the best of my ability, sir. And you'll be suitably rewarded for your efforts. From what you say, the route over the bridge is the best option. If we're fast, we'll have the advantage. With the help of God, we'll win this day. We'll approach from the south and storm them over the bridge. Form up. Forward march. All right. Get your weapons ready, sirs. Forward! Going too slow, you gotta go straight in. Let's go. Oh, ho, ho. Uh oh. Hey, oh, hey, oh, hey. <laughs> There's too many of us. Goodness, countered me. <laughs> Poor guy. 
Catch your breath, Henry. Move that wagon. All right, man. Go away, clear. Up and up. Yeah. Get out of here. Jeez, we got a lot. <laughs> My goodness, I thought I poisoned all these guys. <laughs> Jeez, guys. Don't run from me. Stop running. Church. Jesus, a lot of them. <laughs> uh. Oops, sorry, I kept a rebob. No, 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 no retreat. You're completely surrounded. Oops, sorry. I think I killed more of my own than they have. Oh. <laughs> there we go. I think we're doing okay. Oh. 
Stand your ground, you dogs! Drive them back! my fucking sword. What the fuck are you on about? What's... Hang on. You on it? Fuck me. I thought we left you to the crows. Tough little fucker, eh? What did you do with my sword? Judging by our last encounter, I'd say you made a big mistake coming here. Where's my fucking sword? But then again, maybe you've had some practice. I hope so. Because last time was too easy. How dare you? I have had lots of practice. Come on, runt. Mm hmm. Oh. Weren't expecting that, were you? Ooh. Oh. Curva fix. Curse it. Bring it, dude. confidence I'd say you're flogging a dead horse there. You took him down. On your own. Well done. Nice work. You surprised me. He was a mountain of a man. He was the one who attacked Noyov. And stole your sword, sir. The thought did cross my mind. What did he tell you? taken him alive, the executioner might have gotten more out of him. Oh well, these things happen in the heat of battle. Anyway, we found a trunk full of coin down below. Someone was paying this gang very well. You know, some of Sigismund's barbarians among them. I don't think we've seen the last of this. Whoever engineered it was highly placed. They won't give up after one defeat. This louse was just a pawn. I'm afraid you're right, sir. Well, lad, uh, you live to fight another day, eh? <laughs> That's the fear leaving you, lad. Let it go. Now, put it all behind you. A decent Christian shouldn't dwell on such horrors. I beg to differ, sir. 
I never want to forget this. The time has come for those whore sons to pay for what they did to us. You're right, my boy. But first, we all need some rest. We'll meet later in the upper castle in Ratte, and then decide what to do next. But come what may, you did a good job today. I will make you pay for this. It's time for the next part of our plan. Give the word. Yes, sir. 